Well, I suppose we may as well begin. It's just after a quarter to two. So, uh, Ruth reminded me this morning that uh, this talk is billed as the use of the hands in teaching or words to that effect. And so, I'll talk about that because I think that that is something that's very important. Uh, at the same time, what I'd like to do, uh, I've always found is a good thing on these occasions, is to try and get hands on as many people as possible. And so, uh, of course, there are a lot of people here, so I'm afraid that we may not get hands on everybody, but we shall see how we go along, because I can talk about it and work on people at the same time. So, uh, to begin with, uh, I think it would be a good idea if everybody would just stand up. Now, just see how you're standing, uh, feet apart from each other a bit, so that you've got reasonable balance. And then, as you stand, look out and just see what you can see. Looking at, there isn't very, very much to look at, but look <laughs> at it. <laughs> and as you look there, then you can quietly think, I'm not going to do anything. I haven't got any plans to do anything. I haven't got any plans to move. I'm just standing. And you'll probably realize as you stand that you do better 